Alright, Gene and I are going to make our first run today um, doing the trot line, crab trot line. Don't know if they're there or not. We might come on with no crab. We don't know yet, but I think we'll get a few anyway. But the first thing you got to do is put the crab, the chicken on the line, and that's what I'm working on right now. This is the first time we'll do this. What we got to do first is get these lines out and bait it up underneath here. Just a second, I'll show you. Alright, we've got the line stretch out that's 300 feet of line with these little pieces here what we have to do now is come in and put uh, chicken necks on each one of these and pull it down and then roll it back in the box and we'll be ready to go all right it's gonna take a few minutes here we go gene is this the fun part yeah this, this is the fun part <laughs> gene's uh slowly getting in there and i got some of mine done here but it's gonna take a little bit of time like i said we gotta work through 300 feet of line and get it done here we go all right, we have a beautiful day, Gene. What do you think? A beautiful day. Oh my God. Flat. I had to put my short sleeve shirt on, too. All right, we're gonna hit it right now. Here we go. And we're off, here we go. All right, so far, so good. We've got it halfway in the water here, and it's feeding out. The chicken does wrap around a little bit, but it doesn't seem to get hung up. I could use a little bit bigger pipe, maybe a four inch. I think that's a three inch. But so far, it's feeding out really well. I'm really happy with how it's going right now. So let's get them overboard so we can catch. Here we go. All right, number two is going out, and it's going smooth. I'm liking it, Gene. Look at that. I mean, it is flowing right out. Y'all saw last year I had the spool was spinning all around and all. I think this is a little bit easier, and uh, you can. Throw, just throw it in there and it take, takes less time too, Gene, I think. All right, we'll get them out. We'll go check the other one in just a minute. All right, I think we could go hungry today. We have not got the first crab and pulled. This is the third run that we've done and not got a single crab. My goodness, not one. So uh, we knew we were a little bit early, but we were hoping to at least get see a couple on here, but so far, nothing. Alright, this may be a test run and that's about it. Here we go. We just did the first crab of the 2023 season right here. Gene, it's going to be a hard time splitting that crab, ain't it, huh? It's not even going to make an appetizer. <laughs> hopefully, we end up with a half dozen or so. Hopefully, but that is a first crab for 2023 right there. Alright, we moved to a new location. Got it going out here. And it's feeding good, Gene. I really like how this bucket is working. Pretty. We'll do one here, and then we're going to do another one right in front of this one. All right, let me get rid of this. Get the next layer. Here we go. All right, here's our first pass in a new location. I think I see a crab, Gene. Oh, golly day. I think I missed him. He came off. Man. He fell off before I got a chance. All right, we got to get his boat nose out so I can see. First one had one on it, though. Oh, too much, too much. Oh, there's one coming up, Gene. I see it in there. If he doesn't fall off before I can get to him. And we go. Oh, I think I got him, though. We got one. All right, all right, let's see what we got. That's two, missed one and got one, but that's better than we've been doing anyway. All right, new location, looks like it might be a little better. Oh, there's one on that one. All right, here we go. We're gonna measure them all. Oh, all right, that's something else, that's a weird crab. I don't know what that one is. All right, we gotta look him up. I don't know what kind of crab that even is. I don't think we're gonna keep him though, but. Well, getting a little bit more action in here, so stay tuned. We'll see what we can come up with. Awesome. Well, we have more action on this one than we had any of them, Gene. This is the second one we're hitting right now. Let's see what we can come up with. I don't see anything yet. The last one, the very first one had one on it. I, and I didn't have the camera on, but I did catch a um, female, and we let it go. Here's one right here, Gene. Another one of those ones. That's another one of those weird crabs. we got to check in what the heck they are. I don't know what they are. We'll look at them in just a minute, so stay tuned. We'll check them out. But we did let a female go, a big old female, loaded with eggs. We don't want to mess with them. All right, here we go. I don't think I've ever caught a crab like this one before. I don't think he's edible. What do you think, Gene? You can have him. <laughs> you can have that one, Gene. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that's pretty cool. We're going to look him up and see what he is. We've got actually three of them. We missed one, a couple crabs, and we did get two. I don't know if that one's going to be big enough. All right, Gene, I looked it up. These are called spider crabs. I don't think I've ever caught one. Look at that thing. It points all over him. He does have a nice claw. They say they do eat them all over the world. But uh, I don't, are we saving them, Gene? No, thanks. No, we're not going to save them. <laughs> we're going to let all these spider crabs go. 
Pretty cool looking creature though. You never know what you're gonna run into when you go out on an adventure. Alright, here we go. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and throw all these over right now. Get rid of these guys. I got one more in the cooler that was hanging on there. I gotta get rid of him too. Here we go. Alright, this is our last run. We have the four crabs in there right now. So uh pretty pitiful day for crabbing, but this is the very first run. And the summer just started. We're gonna be wearing them out before it's over with for sure. Alright, let's give it one last shot here and then we're gonna pull them in and be done with the day. Whoa, I got one. One more right here, Gene. Oh my goodness, we did get one. Biggest one. Biggest one of the day. Awesome, we got one more anyway. We were hoping for that. Awesome. Alright, let's see if we can get maybe one more, Gene. What do you think? I don't think so. But we did get one more. Yeah, we're almost out. More fun, Gene! More fun. <laughs> we're gonna feed them. Yeah, we're, we're gonna. What we're doing now is taking the chicken off as we're pulling it in. That way, we want to do it at home and get ready for the next uh, adventure here. But uh, looks like it's coming off pretty good, energy. Not too it bad. Is. Save us a trip when we get back home and clean it. All right, here we go. All right, number one is in the bucket here. So we're getting ready to get the final one. Then we got one more to go, and we'll be we'll be uh, ready to head home. Stay tuned. cooler <laughs> well we didn't get skunk we got five crabs here check them out right here but it was our first run and uh definitely did a full scale testing on the uh new system it worked great i'm really happy with that but we'll be back out stick with us you'll see this thing full of crabs for us over this summer Reggie. within the next month <laughs> yeah all right so don't forget to click like comment below share and subscribe to get the and we'll see you on the next adventure stay tuned it might not have been many crabs, but I tell you what, those five crabs were fat. I got a lot of meat of them. I actually made two nice bowls, you can see right here, of crab meat for me and the wife out of those five crabs. It doesn't take many to get some good meat out of those crabs, especially when they're packed with meat like they were this time. Can't wait. We're going to be killing them this summer, so stay tuned for a lot more crab adventures. I we ended up catching about a half a dozen of these spider crabs. And I don't think I caught a single one last year. Maybe they're more of a cold water crab. I don't know. But uh, pretty strange looking crab right there.